Hello everybody, Harry Coster here with another Thirsty Thursdays. No, no, no. Thirsty for knowledge. Come on, guys. Um, so today we're going to talk about flat feet. I know yesterday, you know, Earl, you know, showed some exercises on, you know, uh, to help with flat feet. So let's talk a little bit about what flat feet are. So let's look here at Adrian's foot, and he actually has a, you know, fairly normal arch. I'm going to ask him just to kind of collapse this. And as you can see, you know, now he has a flat foot. If I ask him to, you know, straighten this out a little bit, now he doesn't have a flat, you know, flat foot. So a flat foot is definitely something that you know can kind of change based on how you're standing and therefore you know the footwear that you have. So that's already the number one thing. You know, somebody that has flat feet definitely should always look for really good footwear. Footwear with a really good arch support, really good support, especially if you're doing activities like you know hiking or running or playing basketball or so. You got to make sure you have really good support. Now, what causes flat feet? Well. Some people just, you know, kind of born with it. Actually, most kids have flat feet to begin with. Um, and they may not develop, you know, really good arches in their, their feet over time. Um, it can definitely, you know, get worse over time based on maybe, you know, wearing really bad shoes for, for a very long time. Um, it could be because of certain medical conditions. You know, rheumatoid arthritis is a, is a very well-known one for that, that you start having falling arches. Um, you know, and definitely as you get older, you'll, you may have more problems with that. So what can we do to, to prevent it? You know, you can definitely do some of the exercises that Earl showed. You know, really wear good footwear um, and then make sure that you really watch, you know, for any kind of pain in your foot. Flat feet themselves aren't painful, but if you start having, you know, pain in your, your feet, it's definitely, you know, time to start looking at what do I need to do? Do I need to look at my footwear? Do I need to start doing some of these exercises? Because you don't want it to be a bigger problem. A lot of times, flat feet, like I said, they're not necessarily painful by themselves, but they can create problems higher up the chain. They can lead to problems like Achilles, you know, tendonitis that we talked about last week. They can lead to knee problems, to hip problems, to back problems. You know, because it's definitely very important that you really watch that. A lot of times I think our feet, they're kind of, you know, undervalued um, you know we, we think well, they're just there that you know nothing's gonna go wrong with them but they really are the base of support for the rest of your body so it's very crucial that you take care of your feet good footwear do some of these exercises you know and keep you know walking running playing sports